For more than six decades now, Southern Hills has hosted major championships and proven itself a stern test for the game of golf's very best. You know, if you look at Tiger, you know, you think of the 63 or the 62 and a half, what he calls it, where he horseshoed it on 18. He was one under the other three rounds. Typically one person, the winner, has played one great round and then held on. <laughs> the, other, the other three. Nobody's really dominated the golf course. It's always held up. Over the course of four PGA Championships and three U.S. Opens, more than 1,000 golfers have played the course. 33 of them, just 3%, have finished the tournament's 280 holes below par. The course tests every part of your game, and, and there's, not a, there's not a hole when you, and I hear this a lot from people who come in, and Patrick Reed was here yesterday, they're just, there's not a, a hole there's, that's a breather. And you think about that, not just for one round, you think about it for four rounds, it, it's going to test your patience. From the Southern Hills Country Club in Tulsa, Oklahoma. The 1970 PGA Championship featured several of the game's most iconic players. Lee Trevino didn't win, but after back-to-back -back 77s, shot a course record 65 with Tulsa and Dan Griffin on the back. He used to represent what's called the Faultless Golf Company, and they had these little Lee Trevino golf balls with a sombrero on them, you know, and uh, I would toss the old ball to somebody in the crowd. They were real excited to get it. Go down, we birdie the first hole, and we go to number two, and he says, hey, Dan, he said, I got my timing back. I think I'm going to have a really good round today. He said, give me, give me one of those royal balls. I said, Lee, we don't have any. I gave them all away. He plays the faultless ball, hits all 18 greens of regulation, shoots a course record 65. Wow. Arnold Palmer made a run at the Wanamaker Trophy, finishing second but it was California native Dave Stockton shooting one under, the only player under par, to win by two. Stockton's caddy was Tulsa native Jed Day, a 21-year-old who grew up playing the course and had just returned home from basic training. He's a scratch golfer. They figured out they hit their irons the same distance. Jed knew the greens. He ends up winning, and Dave made really great comments about Jed, and they stayed friends. Stockton shot 66 on Saturday to take a commanding lead, and a Sunday 73 was just enough to claim his first major title.